King and Wevelgem, we were talking about how we we start with one main goal, one main uh, tactic, and that's what we're gonna do on Sunday as well tomorrow. And the tactics gonna be Julian. If there is situations and things happens and Julian is not feeling good, or situation changed during the race because of other teams and or I'm dropped and I'm too far back. Yeah. Then what, what, whatever then it's it, it's the decision that we're gonna change our main goal have to be taken by Eileen. The thing is we, we have maybe two of the strongest cards here to win in two different uh, ways. There's like we have Eileen with a strong sprint and people around her who can back her up in the sprint. Then we also have Elisa who is flying now in the climbs. If uh, Yulene are feeling that mm. gaps are too big, then the fireworks have to start directly. Mm -hmm. And that's about surprisingly hard, stupid attacks, making, making <coughs> the others really... I was too far behind, I was just behind a crash and I like had to stop in the corner and the race was going without me. I'm so disappointed that I was not there to help in the final and not to do good my job. And yeah, next race. <laughs> Hard? Yeah, because it's so hilly and I'm not really a hilly person. <laughs> But um, there were a lot of downhills, so every time I could be on the front before the hill and lead, try and lead the girls into good position, I was able to recover on the downhill. So I tried to do all that for the first 100, and then um, my last effort was um, 120, and, I mean 112, and that was me done, I was gone. So from then on, you just try and listen to the radio to see what's happening, but sometimes, yeah, sometimes things work, and sometimes things don't go to plan, so yeah, you've just got to... Give it a crack and, went, and give it everything that you've got, and I think that's what we did. It just didn't, didn't work for us this time, so next one. The peloton of Gans have brought so that the declinative slag is will later moeten blijken. We have an achtervolgende group nu op de vroege vluchten. I'm pretty satisfied, even if I would like to be in the front group because I think I had legs to be in the front group. But I'm just beat six since three, four days now, and I think I just miss a bit of brief and I really couldn't brief easy and uh, I miss just this so I hope I can get healthy again and uh, be there for Hamstel and Liege. Yulene said uh, as she wasn't feeling super strong before the moor and uh, she was very honest and uh, and nice uh, that's what we really like in the in the team because there, there is honesty and uh, trust in each other and so um, we swapped the, the roles and in the end I had to be the one who did the races, the race. Um, and then on the Canariberg, uh, the real race started. Um, I went away after uh, Kreuzberg with uh, Van der Breyen, um, um, Nieva Doma and Van Vleuten. I tried to make hard uh, Quaremont and Patersberg and then in the end uh, yeah, Van der Breggen wasn't turning because yeah, it was the tactic of her team and they caught uh, us at 800 to go. It's a pity, but it's bike racing, yeah. Yeah, I really like attacking, I really like to be aggressive. I hate to be a follower and I like when it's a bit of fire and a bit of pepper in the race. It's just so nice when you are not hurting like hell, of course.